This guy's a joker, right? I know, yeah, I know. <laughs> 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 Hello, mystery person. We are going to try and guess who you are. Is it an indoor or an outdoor sport? Outdoor. How many people on your team? 11 on the pitch. I've heard this voice before. Is it football? Wrong. Oh. Hockey? Does it have other equipment other than the ball? Is it hockey? Sorry. <laughs> yes, it is hockey. Yes. Nice. What position do you play? I'm hard, so I'm a defender. Are you on question of sport? Yes. I think I got it. So we got Olympic sport, question of sport, hockey, gold medalist. Is it Sam Quick? <laughs> it is. Yeah. Hey, look at that. Well done, mate. Well done. Thanks, mate. How did you get into hockey? Yeah, I was um, a footballer before I was a hockey player. And at the age of 17, I had to basically pick hockey or football. And I chose hockey. And lucky enough, it was the right path for me. I went and won a gold medal. And you played football as well, <laughs> even though you're a Man United supporter, right? You went uh... to play for City. <laughs> Tell us a story. My brother was playing, and then a scout came and he picked him out and he's like, oh, he's got a twin. And they're like, oh, why don't you both just come along? And then we were playing this game against this Dutch team and the ball came over my head and I thought, I'm gonna really help the keeper out here, like this is gonna be class. And I nudged it and I literally scored, it scored my own goal. Basically, they said, don't come back. <laughs> <laughs> What's your favorite stadium to play at? There are some really cool ones, like you were just saying, Murrayfield's cool, Principality is a- That's mega. Is a, is a tough place to go and play. Obviously enjoy playing at home, Twickers is- yeah, a good stadium and we always get a good crowd. Is the Olympics, like the atmosphere around the games there must be immense? Well, they call it the greatest show on earth. And it's, the best thing about it is everyone from around the world, so many different cultures, so many different people. The Red Roses uh, are leading the way with uh, the rise of women's sport overall. Have you managed to get down to any games? I definitely need to get down there. To be honest, the Red Roses and rugby in general, especially in women's sport, have really led the way for others to follow. Guys, thanks so much for having me. It's been great to chat. Um, I will be wearing the rose, so good luck in all your upcoming matches. I'll be watching and kill it. Thank you very much. Thank you, Thank you very nice much. Appreciate yeah, it. Amazing.